Hello everyone, my name's Daniel and I eat you too. And today we are going to be doing something quite different as today we are going to be doing our very first unboxing. It's not like anyone's gonna care because I only have like 130 followers on the two platforms that I use. So I would like to thank artist Silly Buddies for selling out a bunch of her shit so that I could buy Fuck, what did I buy? I, I bought something from her. I have, like, half a dozen knives, and I can't seem to fucking use them properly, and I'm probably damaged the thing already. Pardon my half-ass setup, as I was too lazy to set up lighting and whatnot, so I'm just doing this on the floor. And, um, please pardon the mess that is my room. I really hope that nothing in this room is showing my address. I also have to be careful not to get fucked by the kind of confetti that's in this. Oopsie dokie, let's see what we have. I already had a vacuum a few days ago, I'm not in the mood to do this shit again. Face is heavy. Now, uh, before we actually get to the real unpacking of this, let's do a quick uh, quality test through the traditional means. Neon duct tape with a light scent of ammonia. <laughs> ah, freshly processed cardboard. I can detect three different carcinogens just from one lick. Oh, so careful as to not fuck the $75 painting set that I purchased. Because I don't really buy shit like this often, I have no idea if I'm supposed to be blaming myself for doing a bad job unpacking this, so I might as well. Oh yeah, a uh, word of advice, never cut towards you. Oh shit, I think I just ruined a piece of it. Eh. Nice. Pestilence, 18 by 18 centerpiece. It's pretty based. Also, I purchased these because these were just a bunch of cowboy photos. I had actually no idea this was based off the four men of the apocalypse, the four horsemen of the apocalypse. So that's pretty based. I am damaging this shit. Sure as hell would rub off to that. And our oh so valued second amendment. Because people are too insecure to exercise control through healthy means, so we just use big flashy weapons. But I can testify to at least in the fact that they are fun to use. I have absolutely no idea what kind of flower that is, but nonetheless still looks nice. And should be it for that. Full as to not damage them anymore. Probably should get the hair out of my face so I can fucking see. 10 out of 10. This is going to be shoved up someone's urethra someday. Okay, so I actually feel like a huge asshole because apparently all of these had names that I didn't even realize it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Cure, Roulette of Life and Death, Cruelty, Plague, I can't read the handwriting, I'm sorry. Medics, Desperation and Desolation. There we go. I think it turned out fine. Probably could have rearranged this a bit better because I think it looks a bit too symmetrical, so I might have to fuck this up. Okay, so I'm actually a massive dumbass because I knew that there was supposed to be more with the packaging. I actually thought that it was supposed to be coming in a separate package. However, I didn't realize that the stuff that she actually did include was just stuck in the individual cracks in the paper. So I had to spend like five minutes fishing it out. And with that, Silly was grateful enough to provide us our very own vivisection bracelet. Good enough. And my personal favorite. Yeah. Fuck. I love how this little goblin shark keychain has been ironed to shit. So I'm just gonna add that to my collection. But yeah, that pretty much finishes up the unboxing and all the shit that came with it. I think there's supposed to be one more package that contains some sort of like Russian crocodile candies, which I'll probably just be trying out in a short. All around, thank you very much, Silly, for all of the shit that you gave me. I'm very much appreciated. And judging by the most likely events, I will probably end up damaging half of this shit within a week. If anyone is at all interested in supporting Silly, she does all of her shit on Instagram, I think. And she also does music on SoundCloud under the tag DJ Poopy Pants. Everything will be linked below if you're watching on a YouTube video. I've never used IGTV before, so I have no idea if links even work regardless. If you like this video, please be sure to like it. If you are mentally sound, you probably won't be doing that. And nonetheless, thank you everyone for watching and